Hello my dear friends, welcome back to Infigam. In this video we have one very interesting question from algebra. Our equation is x plus 6 whole power 5 or x plus 5 whole power 5 plus x plus 7 whole power 5 equal to 2. So let's get started. I will check our equation at x equal to negative 6. So numerator will be minus 6 plus 6 whole power 5 0 over denominator will be minus 6 plus 5 minus 1 power 5 plus minus 6 plus 7 1 power 5 which will give us denominator 0. So for our given equation our solution cannot be negative 6. Minus 6 is not allowed. Now I will use substitution. Let us consider x plus 6 equal to t. x cannot be minus 6, so t cannot be 0. So x plus 5 will be t minus 1. x plus 7 will be t plus 1. Let's put. We will get our equation t power 5 over t minus 1 whole power 5 plus t plus 1 whole power 5 equal to now we can cross multiply we will write 2 times t plus 1 whole power 5 plus t minus 1 whole power 5 equal to t power 5. Now I will use binomial expansion and Pascal triangle. I need to write expansion a plus b whole power 5. So we need to know expansion coefficients. So let's draw here the Pascal triangle. For power 2 we will get 1 to 1 coefficients. For power 3, 1, 3, 3, 1. For power 4, 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. And for required power 5, 1, 5, 10, 10, 5, 1 will be our coefficients. So I will be writing this expansion as with coefficient 1, I will write a power 5 plus next coefficient is 5, I will write 5 a power 4 b. Next coefficient is 10, 10 times a cube b square. Next coefficient is again 10, 10 times a square b cube. Next coefficient is 5, I will write 5 times a b power 4. And last coefficient is 1, so we will be writing b power 5. Now let us put a equal to t and b equal to 1. So I will get t plus 1 whole power 5. I will write a is t. So t power 5 plus 5 times t power 4 plus 10 times t cube plus 10 times t square plus 5 times t plus 1. Now we will put a equal to t and b equal to minus 1. So we will be getting t minus 1 whole power 5 expansion which will be equal to t power 5 minus 5 t power 4 plus 10 t cube minus 10 t square plus 5t minus 1. Now we have to add these two. So I will get LHS as t plus 1 whole power 5 plus t minus 1 whole power 5. This value will come out 2 times plus minus terms will be over. So we will get t power 5 in the bracket plus 10t cube plus 5t. 
So this value we are going to apply here. So we will get 2 times 2 will be 4. Let me write here. T power 5 plus 10 T cube plus 5 T. This will be our bracket. Outside it is 2 times 2. And right hand side was t power 5. Now I will expand. I will write 4 times t power 5 plus 40 t cube plus 4 times 5 is 20 t equal to t power 5. Now I will take all the terms to LHS. We will get 3 t power 5 plus 40 t cube plus 20t equal to 0. Now t is common. Let's take t common out. In bracket we will get 3t power 4 plus 40t square plus 20 equal to 0. Now from here we can write two equations. So we can write either t will be equal to 0 or 3t power 4 plus 40t square plus 20 equal to 0. So t cannot be equal to 0. This equation will be cancelled out. Now we have to solve this quartic equation or I can say quadratic equation in t square. I will write equation here 3t power 4 plus 40t square plus 20 equal to 0. Now I will consider t square equal to a. So I can write equation as 3a square plus 40a plus 20 equal to 0. Let's use quadratic formula. I will write a equal to minus b as per formula plus minus a square root b square minus 4ac divided by 2 times a. Let's put minus b so minus 40 plus minus the square root of b square will be 1600 square of 40 minus 4 times 3 times 20 over 2 times 3 or I can write minus 40 plus minus the square root of 1600 minus 240 over 2 times 3 is 6 minus 40 plus minus the square root of 1360 over 6. Now we can factor 1360. This is 16 times 85. So I can write minus 40 plus minus 4 square root 85 over 6. Now square root 1360 is smaller than 40. So we will get both the solutions negative. So I will take minus common out from this right hand side. I will write here a equal to minus 40 plus minus 4 square root 85 over 6. So once I will take minus common, I will get in the bracket 40 minus plus 4 root 85 over 6. Now we know that the square root of minus 1 is complex number i. So I can write minus 1 will be equal to i square. So I will write here 40 minus plus 4 root is 85 over 6. And then minus sign I will replace with i square. 
Now a was t square, so I will write a or we can write t square. Now we will consider a square root both sides. So t will come out plus minus i times the square root of 40 minus plus we can write plus minus 4 square root 85 over 6. Now t was our substitution x plus 6. I can write here x plus 6 also. Now subtract 6 from both sides, we will get our final answers. x will be equal to minus 6 plus minus i is square root of 40 plus minus 4 is square root 85 over 6. Now we can divide our numerator denominator of radicand by 2. So we will get x equal to minus 6 plus minus i times the square root of 20 plus minus 2 square root 85 over 3. So here we have overall 4 complex solutions. This is the end of the video friends. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye-bye.